So driver appreciation happens every time this year in the fall, and we're in Allentown, Pennsylvania today. We also want to come out here, we want to thank the people who work at the terminals. We certainly want to thank the Gregar shops and the efforts that they put in to, you know, help out the drivers and get them taken care of. You know, Derek and, and the team are going out to make sure that all the shops are up to, to speed, and, and really what we're trying to do is make sure that they have everything that they need to take care of the drivers, the trucks, and the trailers, keep our drivers safe on the road. You know, we're looking forward to all the drivers that we are able to interact with for the next few days, and, and again, please be safe out there. Here at the Atlanta Terminal, uh, we're here just continuing the Driver Appreciation Week. Drivers here in our discussion today, they feel really good about what's going on with our organization. Uh, they like the equipment, they like uh, the services that are being added, they uh, like what they're hearing about terminals and the new construction and uh, services that we're putting at our locations. My name is Regan Daniels, here today in Dallas, Texas at the Driver Appreciation Event. We're out here connecting with drivers. I mean, that's the lifeblood of our, of our business. And uh, it's just a, it's a fantastic effort for us to be able to come out and hear the drivers and see how encouraged they are by the information that we're sharing. And the dialogue back and forth between our leadership team and our drivers that are out there every day was really eye-opening um, and really encouraging to see how much they care. Everybody came together to kind of talk about actual problems Let's talk about practical solutions, and they're having more dialogue about that now. Yeah, we're here in El Paso, Texas, and uh, got a lot of hardworking, committed associates here. And uh, you know, this is a terminal where there's still uh, work to be done, and and so we've got the right people to make the decisions to help El Paso represent, you know, the best in class terminal uh, commitment we have out there. So, you know, we're going to see some uh, improvements and continued improvements to the shops and the offices and to just make the drivers uh, amenities and, and life better here and in all of our terminals. So we're here in uh, Fontana at our terminal location. So I think, you know, it was a very welcoming response from, from all the drivers and, you know, at these events, of course, you know, everybody likes hearing from CL, our founder. Um, just the, the, the things that he has to offer and, and say during the meetings, it was, uh, it was, it was very welcoming from all the drivers. Uh, just a great time overall. We're in our Henderson, Colorado terminal today, celebrating Driver Appreciation Week. You know, we got a founder, of course, with us today, and, um, and it's great to see uh, C.L. Werner on tour uh, at these terminals asking questions about what we can do to better our company. You know, there's still work to be done, but there's been a lot of uh, work that has been completed, and it's it's great to come back to these terminals and see uh, the vision of years past that's now engaged and uh, and completed and making a difference. So here we are at our terminal in Lakeland, Florida, next to the Operation Freedom Truck, uh, down here for Driver Appreciation Week, letting our drivers know how much we truly do appreciate them, uh, get drivers' feedback, understand what areas we can improve in. And I would say overall, uh, the drivers absolutely were receptive to everything that we had to say, whether that was CSA, whether that was new equipment, uh, whether that was driver training, everything, they were, they were very receptive. Overall, drivers felt appreciated, um, and, and we showed our appreciation as well. Uh, we had a great time down here in Lakeland and uh, talking to some more drivers and, and working out some more issues. Uh, all of the meetings that we've held with the drivers throughout the United States have been very positive. Laredo today was no exception. Well, we met with the drivers today to listen to their concerns. So when drivers bring a suggestion to us that has merit, we act on that and we make those improvements. We had a great surprise at the Laredo terminal and two sheriff's deputies from Webb County came. They hid drugs on a, a vehicle and then they showed how their dog is trained to find uh, those drugs. Everybody really got a big kick out of that. So we're here today at our Phoenix terminal and some of the great information we were, we were able to share was the investments we're making in new trucks and trailers, terminals, uh, you know, things like that. Overall, you know, everything was received very well from the drivers. Uh, you know, you could tell that they were ready to interact um, and, and they just appreciate, uh, you know, seeing us here and, and having us be able to answer questions for them. You know, main takeaways is, is really just, just to keep doing this. Just to, you know, keep getting out to our terminals, listening to our drivers, and letting them know what we've got going on and the type of investments we're making in the company and in them. 
Here in Springfield, Ohio, we're here to continue our driver appreciation. We met with a group of drivers to talk about the new facilities that we're putting up, such as the new terminals. We talked about the new trucks that are out on the road, the new automatics that are coming into play. But more importantly, we talked about the CSA score and how important it is to be safe out on the road. We've had a lot of positive conversation. We all believe that the drivers are in good spirits. Yes, there's some issues out there that we need to go back to Omaha and address, but for the most part, we really believe that we're, we're out here and we're helping these guys get whatever they can get accomplished. Here we are in Omaha, headquarters for Warner Enterprises. Uh, today is the conclusion of Driver Appreciation Week. We just got done concluding the two million mile award ceremony, recognizing five of our very accomplished drivers. We're also serving Porky Butts barbecue sandwiches today. We've got the Road Dog Show on Sirius Radio, in which there's gonna be numerous Warner Associates speaking to all our drivers across the country. And it's, it's a great week, one where we have to be very thankful for all the drivers in the industry, the three and a half million that are out there. And we're especially proud of all our Warner drivers. They do a fantastic job. We're here to support them. They know it. I sure hope that we uh, are doing a very good job of expressing our gratitude to them, not just this week, but each day, all year long. So for all our drivers out there, keep up the great job. Be safe. Go Blue.